natapos ang London Olympics, balikan natin ang highlights niyan, pati ang uh, kampanya ng Team Pilipinas kasama natin dito sa, sa ating uh, set. Mr. Roddy Nathaniels, good morning. What was your favorite part of the Olympics? Favorite part of the oh, Olympics? Most memorable for you. The fight of Bariga uh -huh. when he was Which cheated. Which one? The ah, the second one. Ano ba? Oh, oh, yes. What's your take on that? Talagang rob na naman Madaya tayo. Rob na naman Madaya. tayo ng Olympics. Madaya talaga. Mm -hmm. Pero that was not the only fight. Marami naman yung uh, laban. Ka, kahapon manood ako yung laban ni yung Thai fighter against uh, Zhao Ximing. Mm -hmm. Also in boxing. Bugbog sarada. Mm -hmm. Sarado si Zhao Ximing pero panalo naman siya. Uh -huh. Listening to you, it looks like uh, you see Mark Pariga as a promising athlete na meron, pang pwedeng, meron pa siyang pwedeng uh, asahan in the coming Olympics. O oh, yun. No? Mm -hmm. uh, palagay ko, in, in, uh, sinabi ko sa kanila, don't look at Bariga winning in London. Look at him winning in Brazil. What should he have learned from uh, here, from London? Unang-una, parang yung stamina. Mm. His physical conditioning was a little short. Kulang ng kulang. Mm -hmm. Lalo na yung third round, uh, kapus. Mm -hmm. Paano so, ba maiiwasan, Ronnie, yung nababalibag siya eh? He was a put down. It was like a, a wrestling match that we were watching. That, that uh, referee should have penalized yes. the uh, opponent, Zakipov. So many times, but he did not. Kasama na yun dun sa cheating na sinasabi. Oh. Diba? And of course, uh, we have to look back at the performance of the other athletes. You know, we, realistically speaking, we knew it was a, uh, it was going to be really uh, no, uh, a tough thing to, to win a medal against uh, a, you know, a field like what we have in the Olympics. Totoo naman yan. Pero uh, on a, from a personal, you know, parang did they give their personal best? Let's start with the swimmers. To, uh, no, the swimmers never had a chance. Mm -hmm. Never had a chance. Kasi yung two sports, yung at Athletics and swimming, you have to send two entries, mm -hmm. whether you like it or not. Mm -hmm. That's the regulation. And those are, those are blue ribbon events. Oh, oh. Pero kawawa naman sila. They're fighting, they're swimming uh, and running and competing mm -hmm. against the top athletes in the world. We just want to see them sila. do their, you know, beat their their personal records and uh, just see them get better as athletes. And you know, they work so hard. If they qualify, they deserve to go. I think, Totoo you know, naman. especially Totoo for the naman. athletes like, and the Like for instance, Maristela Torres. I, I still think she's one of the best long jumpers in the world. Mm -hmm. Pero change of condition. It's very, it was cold in London. The nervousness, the crowd of 80,000 people, it's very hard to perform mm -hmm. unless you're psychologically ready. That's what's important. Si Heidi Lin sa, uh, ano, sa weightlifting, nag-sorry sa buong uh, Pilipinas pagkatapos ng uh, hindi magawa ang, uh, ang kanyang mission. Did she have to apologize? Well, because so much was expected of her. Yun yeah. ang problema mm -hmm. si Heidi Lin. Uh, so much was expected of her. So she felt para she let down the country mm -hmm. and she apologized. Nothing wrong with that. Pero we feel sorry for her. We should apologize to our athletes that they are not getting the support they deserve. Mm -hmm. We are the ones, as a nation, we should apologize to our athletes. They are not giving, getting the support they richly deserve. Mm -hmm. Think no more. Yung our neighboring countries, Thailand got two silvers and one bronze. Uh, Singapore got two bronze medals. Malaysia got one silver, one bronze. Uh, Indonesia got one silver, one bronze. Mm -hmm. Tayo na lang ay hindi. Wala tayo Wala. inuwi this time around, ano, with mm -hmm. our 11 athletes. But uh, the likes of Heidi Lin, I'm sure we will see her uh, appear in mm -hmm. maybe one or two more Olympics. Sports like archery and, uh, and the, the shooting events, yun, kumis, hit or miss yan eh. I mean, just like the sport Correct. itself, you know. You can do badly one day, but you can have a much better chance and a better showing in the next Olympics. So I'm sure Brian Rosario, our two archers, Dapat talaga suportahan pa natin. We should Totoo see them through. To uh, real. Chiki, pero if you look at archery, I watched very closely the battle between the South Korean women and the Chinese women for the gold medal in the team competition. If you looked at the faces of the Koreans and the Chinese, you would see how sharply focused they were. It was mental toughness. And the gold medal came down to the last arrow of the last Exciting, archer ano? and the Koreans won it because you could see on the expression on the on the girl's face oh. how focused, focused she, was. she was now we that comes with good psychological and mental conditioning mahal yun Mr. Ronnie yan yung oh. kailangan paggastusan yun ang nagiging problema ngayon bakit hindi meron ba? naman tayong pera <laughs> ay nako mahaba mong usapan yun we have to ask you back we have, we have to talk about this at length because everybody has their own take on why mm. we are not winning the medals still and all a chance for us to congratulate our uh, athletes for going out there and just you know, taking a brave stand and really showing what they they have to show for and we look forward to uh, 2014 all of us and before I let you go, 
I cannot not ask you about what you know about the next fight of Manny Pacquiao. Gilang, quickly lang. Unang una, the fight will be uh, as scheduled November 10. November 10, 10 Las Vegas? Uh, Las Vegas mm -hmm. MGM Grand. Mm -hmm. Pagkatapos sinabi si Bob Aram sa akin, April next year is going to be Mayweather. Yun ang gusto sure kong marinig. Yun naman. He's 50 Cent uh, is easy to deal with. Ayun, yung bagong promoter. So, and Mayweather very unusual. He said something nice about Pacquiao. Uh -huh. He said he's an incredible fighter. All right. Okay. He's changed his tune, which means they're getting somewhere. I like that. Mr. Ronnie Nathaniels, of course, nothing to do with the Olympics, but I had to ask you, <laughs> na abangan nila lahat yan. And uh, we enjoy the Olympics. Uh, so, you know, nga, so much history happened, so many records broken, and we look forward to um, much more of that in Rio in uh, 2016. Thanks for coming salamat. over. Maraming Thank salamat. You. Mr. Thank Ronnie, adyan lang kayo magbabalik pa rin. Ang Good Morning Club.